Hey y'all, this is BG Codes and I am Brad Garropy. In this video, I'm gonna introduce you to Firebase. And then in the following videos, I'm gonna show you how to set up Firebase with a few different front-end frameworks. So first off, let's describe what Firebase is. Firebase is a platform on top of Google Cloud that helps you build apps quickly. What it does is it offers authentication, helps you set up a database, gives you file storage, even provides web hosting, offers cloud functions, machine learning, and analytics. It makes setting this up very easy because it provides a nice user interface experience for you as a front-end developer. And what's best about it is it has a generous free tier. So that means we can get started for free without paying anything. Once we reach a certain threshold, it's pay as you go from there. Now, specifically in this series, I'll be using Firestore, the database, to show you how to set up Firebase and integrate it with front-end frameworks. Firestore is a cloud-hosted NoSQL database. What that means is Google hosts the database for you. You don't have to set up a server. And NoSQL means that it does not require a schema. Uh, it's not organized like a typical SQL database in tables and rows. Uh, it's actually more like a collection of JSON documents. So you have a collection, and in that collection there are many documents, and in each document is a JSON object. Something like this. Here we have a user's collection these different documents denoted by their ID, and then it can be any shape of data inside of them. What's really cool about Firestore is that it offers an SDK accessible directly from your front-end applications. So your iOS app, your Android app, or your web app. And this is exactly what we'll be using to uh, integrate Firebase with Firestore in the coming videos. So check out the next few videos to see how to integrate Firebase in your Gatsby, React, and Next applications. See you there.